Well, thank you very much, Perry Road Iron Works and the Ulick Repeater folks. We got eighth in one night. This was the first uh, model that you guys have. Um, and wow, eight rats in one night is incredible. Um, we are gonna get a trail cam and we're gonna set up the new system to see if we can get it live and in action. I honestly didn't expect it to be this good, but even though I'm very thankful that we got eight, there's still probably about 30 more to go. So let's see if we can get those. First, we're gonna release these. We're gonna put them in a bag so their fleas don't get in the car. And we're actually going to let these ones live. We're gonna take them to a good place and release them. Uh, name of my old uncle's house, and we're gonna put them in his pool. Come on. All right, listen up, guys. As you can see from this here footage, it didn't work. The rats were everywhere but the trap. And I think the reason for that could have been one of three things. One, they didn't go in the trap because they didn't feel comfortable. Because it's a new trap and we haven't left it out here long enough. Two, I didn't put this thing here uh, and lock it so they feel comfortable walking on the actual pressure plate, which is what we need to do. So tonight I'm going to put this thing on there and then put a ton of bait there. Three, I put too much bait around the outside of the trap. If there's too much bait on the outside of the trap, they're just gonna eat everything outside of it and they're gonna be like, okay, I'm full. And there were literally eight to nine rats out there as you saw. So, and we've already gotten so many. But, um, so this is what I'm gonna do. Come on over here, kids. Well, we could just get a cat to do this. My neighbor hates my cats because they'd always jump in her yard. So we rehomed them to wonderful, wonderful homes. Also, Doorknob can't eat cat poop or he'll just die instantly. Uh, that's like the one thing, that's like kryptonite for doorknobs. Uh, but I'm gonna go ahead and put this in here. This is going to lock it in place. And we're all out of our friends at Prairie Road Iron Works special gulab jamun. So what we're gonna have to use is the next best thing, guys. I'm gonna use a mixture of I'm going to use a mixture of dog food and some of this moldy scratch grains I told you about. This is just an old uh, moldy orange that I'm just going to put in here. But I'm going to use these scratch grains, all right? You see they're a little moldy. Yeah, I don't want Karen eating these. But now this trap is here. Put it everywhere in there. And I'm going to let them feel real comfortable in there, all right? And now... Tonight, we're just gonna show you what happens. They're all gonna run up on there. They're all gonna be real chill and they're gonna be like, oh, lots of food. And then they're gonna get more comfortable and they're gonna go in there, all right? We're gonna go in there, all right? And then we're gonna go uh, out to a large field somewhere, public land, and we're gonna release the rest of those other rats. So while we're getting this set up and while they're getting comfortable there, come here, buggers, come here. Uh, we are going to uh, get those other rats from the trap released, okay? And uh, we've been giving them food and water, and I thought about rehoming them to people, but then I realized, no, that's the dumbest idea ever. These things could have all kinds of diseases. I'm an idiot for even thinking that. And my parents told me that, and, and I thought, well, we could start a free rat farm for free. But that's, I don't think it's legal, and it's also, even if it is, it's just disgusting. So don't start a free rat farm. Uh, you could freeze them and give them to your snakes. We're just gonna go to some field and let them all go, and we'll get that on footage for you guys. Okay, we got our new friends all loaded up and we're gonna get going. Man, I wanna keep them so bad, but we just can't. <laughs> uh, we're gonna release all these, all these beautiful little rats right into this pond. I'm just gonna throw this trap into the pond. Just kidding. We need to keep using this trap. This is what I'm gonna do. Hopefully none of the fleas or ticks got into the Okay, we're just gonna go ahead and move this. Rat, 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 rat. Oh God, oh God. <laughs> Here we get him, get him. Born free. Goodbye, little friend. Look at him run. All right, boys, you gotta go. We saved the rats. This is the Save the Rat initiative. IDubs did the Save the Squirrels. Oh gosh, oh, there he goes. We saved the rats today, everyone.
Please sure to like and subscribe. Go and get a Ulick repeater uh, weaponized rat system. It is very great and epic. Uh, thank you guys for sending us this. This helped us a lot, and hopefully we can see if we can get some more. Rattity, rattity.